there are times and seasons that you feel that being overwhelmed by worry, anxiety, stress, you, you can't, things that consume your mind and they weigh heavy on your heart. You're overwhelmed by your marriage and the, the, the problems that you're having in marriage and the stress and anxiety or whether it's finances or it's your health, you're trying to fix it. But there comes times where you go, I can't fix it. What do I do? And that's when worry and stress and anxiety, the clouds come rolling in. I love looking through the lives of some of the godliest men throughout history. You know what I see in their lives? I see they go through seasons of stress and anxiety and downright depression. You see that. You see that pattern. I mean, I, I, you see it in Moses' life, Elijah's life, Paul's life, over and over again. But how do you deal with it? How do you move from being overwhelmed to overcoming? Paul would say, God, it's not good right now in my life. This is not what I would call good. This is not what I would sign up for. And many of you feel that. Here's the mantra. If it's not good, God's not done. If it's not good, God's not done. God is a good God who gives good things, and He has a good plan. And if you're going, in my life, it's not good. No, no, it, it might not be good. But that means God's not done. That means God's still working His plan and His purpose. Thanks for watching. Click subscribe below to get more of God's grace in your daily space. And to access the full length messages from Church at the Springs, click the link in the description below. Also, check out faithinhim.life to join the growing community of Christians online who want to interact with their faith daily.